Hey, it's Costardo, with a short tutorial on how to configure racing games in MAME for a joypad. Um, it's the easy method, doesn't give the best results, but uh, hey, here we go. We are going to configure the game Power Drift, the world version. So find the game, right click, and pick the option Properties. Okay, select controllers, um, make sure your joystick input is enabled and set the uh, dead zone and saturation to uh, the value shown on screen. Um, the dead zone is a little bit depending on the joypad you are using, but a value of 0.15 shouldn't be a problem if your uh, character moves by itself, even if you're not touching uh, the stick, then uh, select a larger value. Double click the game, and it should start up. Okay, the game is started. Press the tab key to open the menu go down to the option input this game and press enter. I like to clear all the existing settings from the configuration so I'll just uh, select a line and push delete to clear away the existing inputs. There we are, a beautiful empty configuration file. So press enter and then the appropriate button or stick on your joypad and press down to move to the next line. Rinse and repeat. When we get to pedal analog, that's the actual steering wheel. So we will press uh, right on your left joystick on the gamepad. The next step is entering the uh, brake and gas pedals. Now we will use split axis, that's uh, the way the Xbox 360 pad works. So you have to enter the same control three times or two times before the split axis show up. So for one pedal we use the Z axis minus and the other one is the Z axis plus. And now we're done. Let's start the game. And let's see if it works. And we're ready to play. You may find the controls are still a little bit twitchy, but unfortunately there is nothing you can do within the user interface of MAME to fix this. Uh, next time we will look at an alternative way to input controls and that will involve editing the config files to a certain extent. So uh, I'll see you next time. Bye bye!